937 days of sobriety is what I get after I hit that play button, the Shingarigan music. Now, the Shingarigans is the musicality, <laughs> the melody, the harmony, the strings, the lyrics, everything about this band is next level. For some reason, they have been able to pull me out of a pit that I did not know an end to. And I am the son that I am today, the brother that you look up to, the friend that for some reason you want to associate yourself with because of their music. Now I do not know of a better band to listen to, but for me, my advice, just hit the Shingenigan play button and you will be a changed man. Trust me, I'm changed. I love you Shingenigans. I love you from deep down and I respect you for what you have done in my life. Every muscle of happiness is because of you, and for that reason, I repeat, I love you, Shingani guns. Oh my days, oh my days, the shenanigans, the shenanigans, I mean, come on, where do I even start, where do I begin? X13, I love you man, I love your music, I am... I'm probably your biggest fan. I don't mind saying it. I think I think that's probably true. You know, uh, the shenanigans made me who I am today. I'm pretty sure. And 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 Kwame, if if you if you really honestly believe that the the, the shenanigans are a bad influence on Kenyan youth, on our culture, I I think you're mad. Honestly, it's 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 crazy to me. I mean, because I I remember I remember when I was like 14, 15, and hearing that first shenanigans song for the first time in the car and it was uh, not like me is what it was and it just got me thinking you know you you, I, I, you know I didn't think like that at the time but you have to be open-minded about things you know you can't just dismiss people because they're not from where you're from or they look different to you and um, I want more as well amazing song amazing song and and that just talks about you know it got me thinking about corruption about you know these people who we put in charge and you know sometimes you know they take a bit more than what they need they skim a little off the top you know and uh, and, and and topics like you know injustice patriarchy like these are things that i wasn't thinking about at the time and i came to terms with them uh, a lot of it because of the shenanigans music you know and uh, i just feel like they've been a really really positive influence in my life and I just want to say thank you X13 and thank you Shenanigans because you know I really honestly believe you made me a better person and Kwame Kamau Smith if if you're listening uh, like I think you need an attitude adjustment you need an outlook shift for real man just listen to one album that's all I'm telling you one album damn the Shenanigans Hi guys, what's up? Today is time to support the Shinganigans music. The rock band rocks. You know what I'm saying? The music is so inspiring, word for word. They speak the language of the youth, unemployment, reality of what happens in the society, corruption, tribalism, all those vices, name them. They motivate ladies to become leaders in this patriarchal form of government. For me, music is not just about words, but the meaning of those words. And Shinganigans, they have done their music justice. So before you stand and say that they are a bad influence to the youth, stop and listen. I mean, really listen to their music. X13, big up you guys. You are doing a great job. And I can't wait for your next album. Hello world, my name is Andrew K, and I love music. In fact, I love rock music. It makes me feel great, it makes me feel alive. But of late, it's been really hard to feel this way, you know? You know, all this corruption that's happening in the country, all this stupid politics, all this tribalism, you know? It's just not right. So what do we do? We use music to make ourselves feel better, to make ourselves feel right. Kind of like, kind of like that group, the shenanigans. Hey, yo, shout out to X13. I love what you guys are doing it, keeping it real, saying it like it should be. That's what's up. And you government bozos better stay away from this. This is so, you need a soul to understand music. Something you guys need.
No. No. Shengani guns burned. Even Shengani guns burned. You're saying about fighting corruption and tribalism and being patriotic to your country, their sons get burned. Man, I don't see any common sense in these things. Man, this is never cool, man. And it will never be cool, man. This is not cool at all, man. You know what? Man, I'm not happy, man. I'm not pleased. I'm not pleased. My heart is not at peace at all. No, 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 no. You know what? I'm not going to sit here and watch my favorite band being mistreated, man. How? Man, this is not cool. You know what? I'm not going to sit here. Let me see. I want to do something. I want. I'm going to post everything that is happening on Instagram. Yeah. You know, I'm going to tell people, yes. Yes. You know what? I'm going to create a hashtag both on Twitter and on Instagram. Yes. Twitter and Instagram. Yeah. You know what? I'm not afraid. Will they also want to ban me? Okay. What? Well, I'm not a musician, but I'm a fan of them. Oh, I'm not afraid, yes. In fact, I'm doing it right now. Doing right now? Nice. No! And this is not cool. <laughs>